All right, everybody. Sorry about that. I was dealing with some different stuff over the break there. Ooh. Hello, Brian. You've joined us. Yes, he did, but he promised that he's going to be quiet. Oh, okay. Okay. Brian, do you want to watch uh, a trailer? Yes. Okay. So this next trailer... Um, this next trailer, I don't know. I don't know what to think about it. Um... Right now I have an ad an ad playing. Okay, good. Ad, ad is done. Okay, so this next trailer, I'm not sure. It looks very interesting. It's funny because Steamboat Mickey, uh, which was no. Disney's first property, is is actually going Welcome into to just a second. Combat. Uh, it actually. What's yeah, it's that's my bad. I'm sorry. But Steamboat Mickey actually the um, copyright or whatever the copyright is expiring for it. So now you can actually use Steamboat Mickey from Disney, like the old black and white, you know, with Mickey Mouse on the, on the boat. It's, you know, you know, whatever, and him whistling and stuff. This looks a lot like that, which is probably odd, but if you know what I'm talking about, like if you've seen this, you immediately are probably knowing what I'm talking about. But anyway, if not, let's check it out because we are watching the trailer for... Mouse official sure. teaser trailer. So it's coming at us from IGN. Um, the thumbnail actually, like I said, it looks like Steamboat. I mean, you can see it. Like it looks like Steamboat. Mickey. There you go. There's the thumbnail for it. If you guys can kind of see that, but otherwise, we'll we'll check it out here. So check out the this teaser for Mouse, a gritty, jazz fueled shooter inspired by classic FPS and noir films. Join private detective John Mouston for an all guns blazing battle through a dangerous and corrupt city in this upcoming action adventure game. This devlog teaser features some early gameplay showing off the game's 1930s inspired cartoon rubber hose animation style. Here's a look at a few of Mouse's weapons in action, including the revolver, Tommy gun, and even some dynamite. Developed by Fumi Games, Mouse is available to wishlist on Steam. It its release date is to be announced. All right. Wow, so, sounds very cool. Yeah, no, it actually does. It looks like it might have some some potential here. Uh, let's check it out. We've got a one minute and three second trailer. Are you ready, Brian? Yes. Here we go. Okay. It's like the old Doom games. But this looks very early. Cause I'm, no, one second. Oh. I just, yeah, I just want to point this out. I want to point this out. Do you see how there's like nothing? Mickey Mouse Yeah. Brian said that that's Mickey Mouse. Yeah. <laughs> so you see how there's this? There's nothing, right? This looks like a almost like the beta test. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, I was surprised. It's like, yeah. why can I not see things? Uh, this looks like what the developer made, so yes. that way they could test out combat them internally. But yeah, I'm liking the music. I, I do think it's cool yeah. that you can blow the mouse's heads off. <laughs> yeah, I was like, well, definitely not a game for kids. Yes. Yeah. Okay. I'm liking the... So this has got to be, like, super early access. Or like, super... Not early access, because it's not coming up, but, you know, super early in development. I mean, he said that it's a teaser, you know? Yeah. But I, mean, I don't like, know if I like that they had all. Well, I'm just saying, like, even the, the world that they're showing us, the levels that they're playing through aren't even done yet, so... That's how early... And see, that's well, what I was thinking, too. It's like it's like cupheads. See, that's the thing. Yes, it's like it's... cupheads. Um, yeah. So tell me what you think. Tell me how much you would pay for a game like this. And the thing is, is that like I said, the the levels aren't even complete. But I it's, do think like, the aesthetic. Question. Like I, I wouldn't. I don't know. I I need to see the, you know, the trailer of the, of the game when it's over. You know, when it's completely done to be able to tell you how much would I pay for it. See, I think that this is what it's gonna. This is what it's gonna look like, you know. And then, and then here is we're looking. This is like I said. It looks like this is just them showing us something. Right here. You know, you like it's. Yeah. 
Uh, see, Fumi games, though, they don't have any other games. But it, it looks like they're trying to basically do like a Cuphead style thing. I, I don't know. I think that it has great potential. The only problem with it is for a teaser like this, what we're looking at, like I like the gunplay. The gunplay looks good. I, I hope that as you're, as you're shooting in the full release, as you're shooting at enemies, that you can see the bullets making impact or see something. Because if you look here... Um, if you look here, you're not seeing any of that. Uh, and like I said, you know, early, it's early. So this is one to definitely watch out for though, because it looks like it could just be some, some good fun. And probably not like some epic thing, but it just looks like it could be some good fun. I do. I really actually do like the aesthetic and I hope that they're able to pull it off in the end. I'll just say that. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, but otherwise let's check it out. Uh, what people are saying about it in the comments. So. Uh, rare to see such clearly in development footage. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, this is so much in development. Yeah. Uh, this ships $70. It's an indie game, so probably not. Uh, the publicity the game was getting online by quickly throwing together a trailer and a Steam page in, in like a day. Okay, so it sounds like they stomach this, this game, somebody caught on to the game and said, oh, look at this interesting game, and then they just really quick put this out so that way they could they could have something for people to see about it. As it was, as it was kind of in the, the news or whatever. So that, and, and, and hey, I do not, I do not have any problem with that. Like this, the fact that this is as in as early in development as it is, doesn't bother me. I think the trailer was good. They just basically, they're just, it's exactly what they say. Hey, this is a teaser. It's just showing you the aesthetic and what we've got so far. So. Um, probably going to be a while till we see the game, though, for sure. Um, this looks amazing artistically. Would love to see how much of it gets carried through and how the story is. If there will be one, would be great if it's just more than a nice-looking shooter. So, yeah, I mean, it said that it has some detective elements, so this is obviously just the gameplay aspect. Sorry, the, the combat aspect and not um, the, um, you know, not the, the detective part of it or anything like that. So, yeah. Imagine if Fallout incorporated the style too for the like the mini games or something, but the Vault Boy, the game's got potential. It's definitely unique. Yeah, I like I said, I definitely think that it looks it definitely looks um unique. I wanna hear this song because I have no idea what it is, but the look on this guy's face. <laughs> um yeah, alright. So I mean probably I, I'm with you on this. I'm not sure if it's good. I'm not sure if it's going to be bad. I don't know how much money I would pay for it. They don't either because it's not on Steam. Um, I mean, like it's like it's on Steam, but I mean the price isn't on Steam yet. And, you know, very early in development. Just one to watch out for. It has potential. I think that probably I wouldn't pay more than 30 though. Yeah, definitely not a triple-A game. Definitely not a triple A game. Maybe, yeah, I would say 30. Uh, I usually say 20 or less for different games. It I depends need, how long it is. How long it is, yeah. I usually, it's like 20 or less, 30, 40, you know, and then I go up by 10s, but probably I just need to say, be like be saying like 10, 10, 20, 30, you know. But anyway, uh, I would say it's not a 20 or less game. It's not, it's not, but I, I, I would, I, I would say you're probably right. I, I could see them going as high as 40, depending on, how it ends up in the end, but I wouldn't say more than forty dollars. Probably thirty is the good place for it to be. So, um, yeah. All right. Well, um, definitely want to watch out for if I see any other trailers for it. I'll try to remember, try to remember this one and, and put it put it in in any other. A lot of likes so. though. Yeah, I, you know what happened too is I actually went to get the extension and then they disabled the extension. So now I can't see how many dislikes it has. It has a million, a million views to 71,000 likes. Um, I think that it looks good aesthetically and if they can pull it off in the end game, um, that'll be cool. That'll be cool to see. So, all right, let's move forward though. Here we go. Don't forget to check me out on Twitch and join the Discord where you can voice chat with me while a live stream and you won't be recorded or anything on YouTube and Twitch, so that's pretty cool. You can also find me on Facebook and Instagram. If you like to read, you can see my after action reports on my blog. And if you are interested, you can get some merch from my spring store. The links for everything are in the description below.